First news story tonight is NASA warns of huge solar flares causing blackouts on Earth. Astronomers have warned of solar storms and other extreme space weather over the coming days and weeks as an active part of the sun rotates into view. The activity is expected to cause auroras and potential blackouts on Earth, with NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory recently capturing the most powerful eruption of 2025 from a newly emerged sunspot region. Class is an X2.7 flare, the highest category possible for a solar flare. High frequency radio signals were disrupted for around 10 minutes, according to space weather forecasters at the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration in the United States. NASA noted that ongoing flares and solar eruptions from this region could continue to impact radio communications, electrical power grids, navigational signals, and pose risks to spacecraft and astronauts. The sun is currently at the peak of its 11-year activity cycle, which we've talked about a lot on this program yeah. recently. And known as its solar maximum period, this is a result of the star's magnetic poles flipping, which causes it to transition to an active and stormy state. Disruptions from solar flares can also be accompanied by auroras from coronal mass ejections, which is when charged particles from the sun pass through the Earth's atmosphere and create colorful displays known as the northern lights. The most active region of the sun is currently rotating to face Earth, leading to forecasts of more significant space weather. Yikes.